فعاش القلب إخلاصا وصرت تحومك الطير تحلق في ثقافات وتنهل من روبا الخير Just one incident for which we can gauge the manner in which that group that Allah placed the label upon رضي الله عنه ورضو عنه Allah is pleased with them they were pleased with Allah that group that took deen directly from Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam they left behind a legacy for this ummah till qiyamah as to what it means to show Allah to give oneself over to Allah when Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam took the oath in Mina 72 people came from Medina Munawara they took an oath of allegiance in the hands of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam inviting him to come to Medina Munawara what was the essence of that oath they said ya Rasulullah come to Medina we will defend you with our lives. Our homes will be broken. Our blood will be spilt. Our women will be made widows. Our children will be made orphans. We will become paupers. We will sacrifice everything. But we will not allow one hair on your body to be harmed. Amongst that group of 72, there were two women. Umm Mani and Umm Ammara radiallahu anha. Umm Ammara had two sons. Abdullah and Khabib bin Zayd radiallahu ta'ala anhumah. Musaylama Kadhaab falsely claimed to be a Nabi. He had a huge army. Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam sent an emissary to give him dawah to Islam and to give up this falsehood. The son of Umm Ammara, Khabib bin Zayd was sent. It is an international rule that an emissary is not harmed. But this mal'oon, Musaylama, Defenseless, unarmed, the Sahabi comes with a message from Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. What does he do? He imprisons the Sahabi, ties him up. And in front of his army, he orders that a sword be brought. The sword is placed on the right shoulder of the Sahabi. And Musaylama asks him the question, Do you bear witness that Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam is the Nabi of Allah? He says, yes. Do you bear witness that I, Musaylama, am the Nabi of Allah? He says, I can't hear you. His right hand is cut off. And the sword is placed on the left side. Same question. Do you bear witness that Muhammad is the Nabi of Allah? Sallallahu alayhi wa sallam says, yes. Do you bear witness that Musaylama, myself, and the Nabi of Allah? says, I can't hear you. His left hand is cut off. Then the right leg is cut off. Then the left leg is cut off. Then a metal sheet is brought and piece by piece, piece by piece, the flesh of the body of the Sahabi is cut. And he suffers a lingering death of such torture and such pain that even the army of Musaylama cries to see the manner in which he mutilated the body of the Sahabi. When the news reaches the mother of the Sahabi, Umm Ammara radiallahu anha, my respected brothers and sisters, they were mothers, and today we have mothers also. Cry tears of blood, cry tears of blood. When you see the young mother of today with her hair open, blowing in the breeze with the ray bands on, driving a fancy car, taking the nine or ten year old little young girl just in skirts and frocks dropping off at the playground to play look at that young child and ask yourself the question who is going to teach her that she has to become the daughter of Fatima who is going to teach her that she has to become the daughter of Khadijah al-Kubra and Aisha radiallahu ta'ala anha who is going to teach her the motherhood of Islam who is going to teach her the haya and the shame and the modesty of Islam who is going to make her such that from her lap tomorrow the flowers of Islam will emanate. The mothers today, Allah protect us, have not become those sources of Islam that they were supposed to be. Not only them, in our homes, where is the environment of Islam? Where is the environment of Iman? This is why our elders are telling us, establish the halqa of ta'alib in your homes. Those were mothers also. Those were mothers also. The news comes to her. This is what Musaylama did to your son. What is her reaction? She says, Lihada liyawmi ardatu. Lihada liyawmi She says, I breastfed, I breastfed my son because of this day. I nurtured him and brought him up to see this day. And I will get my reward from Allah. I will get my reward from Allah. 